hello and welcome to my channel in this video I am going to tell you about how exactly to generate a certificate using Google Forms so let's begin with the video so how exactly to access Google Forms you just have to type Google Forms and on the first link when you click you will be asked to sign in to your account and once you do that in that case you will be taken up to this screen where you can see google forms where there are certain templates which are already available and then there is an option of a blank with a plus so now you have to create a form and for that simple you just click on the plus button and then there will be a blank form that opens in that blank form you just enter your details which means the questions and other things that you have to put into it here I have generated a form named exam and I have input into it two questions along with a detail that is about the name of the person so I have got three questions over here uh, which talks about the name and the other two questions uh, for the exam now how to generate a certificate is our uh, um, question and so for that you just have to go on the three dots that you are seeing uh, on your uh, screen the three dots next to your profile image the three dots next to your profile image and before i mean sorry after the send button that is where you will be clicking and here you will be getting an option of add-ons so once you click on these add-ons you just have to go to certify m add-ons and then install it so simple just click on it click on the certify m icon that you are seeing using the three dots and then say install so it gets installed once you have this installed you will be finding the add-ons symbol on your uh, main screen and once you click on it you will be getting an option of certify m if you click that you will be getting another pop-up window which says show certify m controls recent certificates about certify m and help we go to show certify m controls here you will be seeing that the certification is being turned off that you have to turn on and here you have put certain templates over here which are predefined so using the predefined certificates you can easily generate a certificate of yours but in case you have to generate a certificate of your own which means now you have to generate a certificate using your own design in that case what to do nothing you just go to another window and open google slides so just type in google slides and the first option that you're getting just click on that and again using a blank slide you are going to create a blank slide so here you have a blank slide and simple you just have to type the content that you want to be displayed on your certificate like you can use this is to certify that then the name of the person and has passed the whatever be the name of your exam or your test that you can put it up certified on if you want to place the date and the certificate id if you want it to appear on your certificate you have to actually use certain identifiers for doing this and that you can easily get on your uh, mm, on the website of certifym.com so if you say i have to use my own certificate and you just on the template if you template of the certif certify m there using the templates if you say that you have to have your own certificate then using the current template you can select your slide over there okay so 
anyways right now nothing would be visible so all I'm trying to say is you have to use certain identifiers which I have shown in my video and this you can also find on the URL which is displayed over there now these identifiers are the merge tags which means uh, the description of these tags are also mentioned over there so that is how I have created uh, the the merge tags and so this way these you have to place and then you have to save your slide so you just have to save it okay and then return back to your forms and there what I was saying is using the certify M pop-up which appears and you select up the option of show certify M control and here in the templates what you need to do is you have to go for your own certificate okay so that when you say it a setup your own certificate dialog box will appear and the current template currently it is shown as golden which is the default so you just have to say select a new file and then uh, your files would be shown okay so whatever your presentations are saved that would be over there so you just have to select that particular presentation from here and then say save change save changes okay now here in the advanced option if you go you just have an option of you have many options over this but what I am trying to show you is that you can send your certificate as a PDF or an image for that you just have to select the option from here and say save changes now using the preview of this particular form I am just going to fill in certain details over here so I filled up my email address that is simonrofficial at gmail.com the name I have just placed up a name that is Andrew Simon which is different from what you get in the custom templates just to show that yes this is functional I have entered my responses and then I say submit so when you submit it is showing that if you have passed you will receive a printable certificate shortly and uh, yes in case if this certificate is not being received on your generated mail id you just have to go to the spreadsheet which you can generate using the plus button mm, in your responses tab you get a plus button just click on it and you will be getting a spreadsheet over there here you can see the scores and if at all it is below you can send a mail and if it is above the set percentage by default it is shown as 80 percent if you are generating a certificate say for participation or something you can keep this to zero percent also using your certify m controls and in case if the certificate is not yet generated using the certify m controls or the the add-ons button you can just say recent certificates and just follow the instructions therein to send the certificate again so once again if you have to generate your own certificates your own design certificates you're going to use google slides and then with the help of the merge tags you just have to place it at appropriate place and save it with the name and then using the certify m controls using the templates you just select your slide as a template and say save changes this is how you will be executing your own certificates now your uh, google slides actually works exactly like microsoft 
presentation microsoft powerpoint presentation and so you can insert images and other options you can have a background image and other things you can have a design of yours and that's exactly the way it is just that it is being saved on your google drive i hope this helps in you to generate up certificates of participation of completion awarding it on to the grade certificates and other things using the scores and other things that you can place upon your certificates and provide them to your students on the basis of their uh, assessments they can be given a certificate or simply a certificate of participation can be issued for any kind of competitions or maybe any webinar that you are conducting simple it is very simple if you like this video just hit the like button if you want to follow such videos do subscribe my channel and if you have got any queries or suggestions please post them in the comments below thank you and have a great time ahead